Howdy and welcome back. Today we're going to take a look at this Looney Tunes set from the Canadian Mint. Uh, first a few things about it. They are, each coin is a half ounce of four nines silver. Each coin had a mintage of 30,000. There are eight coins in the set. And if I remember correctly, and don't quote me on this, um, they did come back out. They did come out in 2015, that is for sure. I, I think they came out once a month, and, and then with the last coin that they sent you, they sent this box, this collector's box with it. Um, so I will open up the box and show you. Each coin came in its individual box. And on the box, you can see each box makes a little picture. Kind of neat, huh? So like I said, each coin came in one of these boxes. And just open it up, and each coin comes with a certificate of authenticity right here in the Ziploc bag. And each one has a saying from, from the character that is printed on the coin, or minted on the coin. This one is Daffy Duck. $10 coin, 2015. Daffy Duck and the Queen Daffy Duck is one of my favorite characters the way him and Bugs always go back and forth just cracks me up every time now um, one thing I did forget to mention when they're in the box like when, when they're in the case and each box, each, in, each individual box makes a picture. They actually make two pictures. You can flip them and make a second picture. So yeah, that is the Daffy Duck coin. You're despicable. <laughs> okay. I'll just put that one there. I'm just going to coin number two, which is this one. Okay. It's Bugs Bunny. Another certificate of authenticity. Bugs Bunny behind it. What's up, Doc? Oh, come on. There we go. Hey, okay. Bugs Bunny. A queen. I like how the queen is raised on that. It's pretty nice. And of course, the characters on the back are raised too. And again, $10. 2015. Very nice coin. And of course, each one also comes in these little plastic containers as well. I guess I could go ahead and show you the back as well. I didn't even think about that with the other coin. Okay. 
And that's coin number two. Coin number three. And who's this one gonna be? Ah, Sylvester. Sylvester, search or forget of authenticity again. Suffering Succotash. $10, 2015. His coins were really well done. I really enjoy them. Now they came out with some colored versions. I never got a chance to pick up. I do plan on picking them up in the future. Eventually. And when I do, I will absolutely showcase them here. $10. 2015. Oh, and I just noticed something else. I don't know if it'll... Yeah, it just says... Right there, WB. It's copyrighted by Warner Brothers, obviously. Coin number four. Just give me one quick second here. And set up the rest of my coins. Okay. Coin number four. Who's this one going to be? Ah, Tweety Bird. Again. Bird, Certificates of Authenticity, I Taught, I Taught, Putty Tat. $10.2015. Tweety Bird. Queen. Yep. Very nice coin. Okay. okay, coin number five. Who is this one gonna be? Oh, this is the this is the that's all folks coin. Which actually I kind of got them out of order, I think, because this was the last one that was sent, but that is okay. That's all, folks. Again, Certificate of Authenticity. Sylvester, Foghorn, Leghorn, and Tweety. But all of the characters that are on the coins are on this coin. That's a really, really neat coin. Again, 2015, $10. Wish my phone would focus a little better. That's all I got right now. Uh, 
another very nice coin. Sparkly. Anyway, one more time with the queen. And the case. Royal Canadian Mint. Foghorn Leghorn. Foghorn Leghorn is another one of my favorites. He's always tormenting that damn dog. <laughs> okay, coin number six. Marvin the Martian, Certificate of Authenticity, and Marvin is right behind there, as you can see. Where's the kaboom? And he's, Marvin is one of my absolute favorite Looney Tunes. Even though he wasn't in nearly as many as the rest of the characters. Still a hilarious character. I guess I should show you the coin, eh? <laughs> okay. Now this one... Um, I was looking at it once and I kind of dropped it and cracked the uh, case here. I haven't been able to find, uh, see right there, crack. I haven't been able to find another one of these to replace it, and once I do, I will absolutely replace it, but I have a bad feeling that these were um, created just to fit these coins, and you probably can't buy them anywhere, but eh, maybe I'm wrong. That's another reason I started this channel, because although I've been collecting coins for about 15 years, I clearly, obviously, don't know everything and I would like to learn more. <laughs> Marvin the Martian. Uh, I just realized I keep forgetting to show you, show you guys the back of the box, but they're l literally all the same. The only difference is that each box, you know, tells you what's in it in English and in French because this is from the Canadian Mint. French is the second language here in Canada, officially. Coin number seven. Ah, the Roadrunner. How he torments Wiley e. Coyote. Wiley e. Coyote just never quite ever captures the Roadrunner. Again, certificate of authenticity. Roadrunner's in the back there. Beep beep. Or bip bip in French. <laughs> that's gonna that's a hilarious coin. Again, twenty fifteen, ten dollars. Queen. <laughs> uh. Yeah. I don't know why I keep doing that. The entire reason to have these coins is to look at them. I should put them in the cases correctly. Sorry, sorry for my gnarly thumb over here. I've got really dry skin that never wants to go away. I've tried all kinds of lotions and whatnot. Anyway. Oh, 
We are up to the very last coin. Oh, actually. Okay, the eighth and final coin. Wild E. Coyote, super genius. He likes the way that sounds. Certificate of Authenticity. Wild E is right behind there, as you can see. Super genius. Fifteen, ten dollars. Wiley is riding a rocket. Even a rocket isn't quite as fast as the Roadrunner. That Roadrunner is one fast dude. Okay. Now that I showed you all the coins, I'd like to show you a little bit more about the case. I let's see. So let's move these all to the side. This is the case. The, we all have these little straps. So when you put them in, you're easy, more easier. It's easier to get them out. Um, give me one minute. I'll be right. Back. Now it turns out in the in the beginning of this video when I said that the other side of these boxes makes a picture when in the case I was wrong because it just basically as you can see shows all their their feet and then the body of Wiley Coyote so but if I flip them this way you can see that you see I make a picture all right um let's see here So, let's see if I can do this. I think Daffy goes there. Bugs goes there. Sylvester goes there. And then Sylvester's foot and Tweety. Go there. Oops. Wiley Coyote. Marvin and Foghorn Leghorn. There you go. And that's about it today. Thanks for watching.